Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Leo. This is for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for the week of December 28th through January 3rd. So this is my second Leo reading. I already did one, but I'm not going to share it because I feel like there's a little bit different message in that. I feel like you guys are losing faith, okay? You're losing faith in, maybe you're losing faith in humanity, um, the first card out was the moon, which is fear, fear of the unknown, um, not seeing something clearly. I feel like you're, you're, you're very worried about something because it was, it was the moon. And then we had the star reverse right underneath it. That's lack of faith. Okay. You're very worried, fear of what's going to happen. You know, I think that you need to believe and you need to have faith. You need to have faith in humanity, have faith in yourself, have faith in the unknown. And I know that's scary. I know that's hard, but I feel like, I feel like you guys are feeling uneasy and there's a lack of clarity in, in your, in your wishing for clarity and it's just not coming, right? You're wishing that you could have all the answers. It's not coming. You need to listen to yourself. Okay. You need to listen to yourself. You need to listen to your gut. You need to listen to your intuition. You know, don't, don't rely on other people. I feel we had the three of cups reversed as well. It was way down here, but we still had it. So that, that told me that you may be receiving some poor advice from friends. Listen to yourself. Listen, the, 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 the uh, moon card is all about intuition. That was the, the main card that came out here. It's the message from the universe. Listen to your gut. Listen to your intuition. Yeah, you're fearful. You're scared of what's going to happen, you know. Have faith. Have faith. And you're, you're, you have the answers within you, okay. Um, I feel like there's nothing to fear, really. I know that you're fearful, but I feel like you're going to a better place. Over here, we had the Six of Swords. So that is somebody leaving something behind, okay? We also had the Four of Pentacles before that Six of Swords. So that Four of Pentacles was holding on to something that is materialistic, focusing on your stability, focusing on your security, right? You're really, you're trying to save something. You may be trying to work on saving money or saving an asset, something you're holding on to. Whatever you're saving, you're holding on to, I think it's going to work to your benefit, okay? Your your hard work is going to pay off. It may not be working or paying off at the moment. You may feel like it's not paying off, but I feel like it is. I mean, did have the Six of Swords, one of the last cards I pulled. That is, that's a time of transition. It's a rite of passage. It's you going to a better place, leaving behind all this trouble and turbulence and uh, worry. Okay. So you are headed to a better place, but th the main message that I got was for you to have faith and believe. Okay. Believe in, in, um, humanity, believe in yourself. This is a test of faith. When you get the star card re reversed, you may be in a state of depression right now because you're so worried that the moon is worried. You're so worried about not knowing what the outcome is, you know, have a little bit of hope. You know, you, you ever see those signs that say hope, believe, faith, and they, or they go faith, believe, hope. Put them on a the little sticky, okay, and put them around your house. You know, you need to you need to have that hope and faith and believe, believe that things are gonna work out. Okay, so let's get started for Leo. What message do we have for Leo? You may be in troubled times right now, but they're not going to last forever. Your fear is your biggest problem. Chariot. Now this is victory, success. You will be victorious, but this means... That you will have to master your emotions because a chariot is in the upright position is about mastering emotions. It's finding the discipline. It's finding the self-determination. It's finding the uh, discipline, determination, willpower to overcome opposition. You may be dealing with some opposition, but I'm going to tell you one more meaning of this card. Replacing fear with faith. 
So you need to replace that fear with faith. You will be victorious in whatever this is. Some of you may have to do with moving because the chariot is a card of moving. In some decks, they're literally packing up the vehicle and moving. Somebody may be moving. You may be fearful. Replace that fear with faith. Everything happens for a reason. The star card is a card of purpose. It's a card of reason. It was reversed. Whatever happens, it's meant to happen. Believe it. You are moving to a better place. You will be victorious. This is taking a journey. Some of you are taking a journey. You need to control your emotions during this time. Look at that shit. Came flying right out. Remember I told you the moon was the first card. Changes in your life. That is what is happening. The moon was right here before. Okay, so you definitely have some unseen changes. They are below the surface right now. And it's a little bit scary not knowing what they are. But you're about to see them. There are definitely, there's going to be some changes. These changes are going to make you happy. Trust me. Have faith. One more card. Well, two more. Mmm. Handshake. A meeting with a stranger could be important. Boat. Ooh. Money or property through an inheritance, winning or windfall. So you are going to be obtaining something. Okay, you're going to be obtaining something. And you're going to be meeting. It feels like you're making an agreement with somebody. This agreement moves you, moves you forward towards success. This is definitely a major change and it does involve some sort of property. Okay, whether it's a vehicle, because this is a car, or a home, whatever it is, there is some sort of agreement that is being made that is going to change your life. Okay? Could be dealing with the Pisces, could be dealing with the Cancer. It doesn't have to be, but Sagittarius, change. Change. This is this is about getting something better, exchanging something lesser for something better. That's what's happening here. But this is a need to accept and allow and go with the flow. This is a card of evolution and purpose. This is you changing, evolving, a need to be grounded, but also a need to be fluid. So you are going to be making some compromises. You're going to be needing to blend as changes are starting to happen this week. This is the journey of life. Really it is. You are taking a journey. You have evolved. You are evolving. And you're going to be receiving something better. You're going to need to accept this change that is happening. And manage your feelings. Manage your feelings as big. As big, 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 big. You need to have that self-discipline to change. It's going to... Self-discipline to accept change is big, 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 big. 
king of swords in the past in reverse there's been some sort of abuse mental abuse verbal abuse physical abuse neglect trying to be too logical not seeing clearly being manipulated you may have been manipulated by another person you may have been lying to yourself I mean, the King of Swords in reverse is somebody who uh, isn't seeing clearly, is cold and uncaring, abusive, hard. Maybe that's who you're leaving in the past. Princess of Pentacles reversed. Now, this Princess of, that's like Page of Pentacles reversed. This is a current blockage that is standing in the way of you achieving success. What is that blockage? What is that blockage that is standing in the way? Lack of ambition? Lack of drive? Fear? What's the blockage? There's a blockage standing in the way. No focus? Lack of commitment? Not wanting responsibility? We have somebody here that's not putting in much effort. That's what the Page of Pentacles in reverse is. Somebody who's not putting in effort. Not wanting to start over. The Empress. So the Empress is the, is the giver of life. So this is a time of fertility. It's a very fertile time. It's a very... Uh, it's a time of abundance. It's a time of love. This is what the universe wants for you. The universe wants abundance and love for you. That's what's in your future. This is the birth of a new life. This is abundance. You're going to be getting a gift. This is a blessing. You are going to be getting a gift. but you And you may not have to do anything for it. Perhaps the universe can give you this gift. Because this is not having to put in effort. This is a gift. This is a blessing. This is a blessing. So you're, you're going to get some sort of blessing. Okay, you are. Trust me. You are. You're going to get some sort of a blessing. You may not have to do anything for it. I feel like whatever it is, you notice where the Empress is. It's a money or property through an inheritance, winning or windfall. You're going to get something very abundant. This is something that you have been waiting for. It's in, but you're you're going. But the only way that you're going to get it is to accept change. Okay, you're going to need to allow yourself to go in that direction. Don't don't block it from happening because this this could be a blockage. The Page of Pentacles reversed. If somebody you know saying, "Nope, I don't want it." Oh, this is the universe, 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 bringing you something abundant and beautiful. But it may require you to accept some sort of responsibility. Princess of Swords. So we definitely have message coming. It may make you feel conflicted. This message that is coming could be an offer that you didn't expect. I feel like it is an offer that you didn't expect. There may be, you may need to compromise. You may need to make some compromises, okay? Because this is a card of compromising. You may need to blend to create harmony. You know, you may. I feel like you're going to be receiving an, a, a message from somebody that... Uh, this person is giving you a message that makes you feel uneasy. You know, it makes you feel uneasy. It may be a message that you weren't expecting. You weren't expecting to hear this. And you will need to make some compromises. That's what's happening. You're going to need to make a compromise. 
There could be a short delay of some sort, but you are going to get exactly what you want. Um, there's something that is overdue as well. You are. This is a long overdue opportunity. You've been waiting for this opportunity. It is coming. When it does happen, it's going to happen fast. You do deserve this. You're going to be receiving some news that changes your life. <laughs> That's exactly what it is. This is news that changes your life. Your life. Okay? You're going to be receiving some news that changes your life. I feel like... Uh, you may try to put your guard up. You may try to say no. Don't say no. You may say, nope, I'm not interested. No, don't do that. It's time for a change. It is time. This is timing. It's This is divine timing. It is. You're definitely going to be receiving some direct communication from somebody. That changes your direction. Five of Pentacles reverse. Now this is light at the end of the tun tunnel. Starting to see improvements. If you have been struggling financially, you are going to start seeing improvements. You may have lost sight of your goal. You need to refocus. I feel like we have somebody here that has been experiencing some hard times. But now we have a turning point. You're going to be receiving something. It's like a gift. It is a gift. It's a gift from the universe for all the hard work, for all the pain. Okay, because the Empress has pain for all the pain that you have been through. Get prepared to make an agreement with somebody that is giving you an offer that you should absolutely not refuse. This is going to change your life forever. It moves you away from some sort of abuse. You're about to get something better than you even asked for. Don't say no. It's time. It's time for you to receive. It is. It's harvest time, okay? Money or property through an inheritance, winning, or windfall. There it is. Took a minute, didn't it? But the ship is coming in. Good luck. <laughs> 